Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a quick everyday glam look for you. Now I typically wouldn't wear this look every day to class or something. I would just wear spot conceal, eyebrows, and mascara. That's about it for that. But um, this is like a look if you want to just look cute put together. It's basically focused on skin. No eyeshadow included in this look. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And also tell me what you guys want to see further on in my channel. I will be getting new lighting equipment and a new camera very very soon so make sure you guys stay tuned so um for my everyday look i usually just wear brows um spot concealer and mascara honestly but this is going to be a glam everyday look so i'm gonna first start by brushing my eyebrows out and i just got my eyebrows freshly done i'm actually having like a allergic reaction to them right now but we'll get over it so um i'm gonna start with the elf dip brow pomade it's actually a good like really good dupe i think it's around four dollars for the um anastasia dip brow but the only thing about this is you have to have patience i usually tap it on the back of my hand because girl we can go very overhand with this so what i'm gonna do is start by outlining my brows with this and like i said you want to be careful because the shit is strong and you can go overhand very quickly trust me I get out of hand every day when I'm rushing with this I have a strong ass eyebrow and I hate it and so also what you don't want to do is start filling in right here because that's where we get that boxy brow that no one really likes well I guess some people like it I'm just gonna go ahead and just outline that again don't forget to tap the access on the back of your hand so it's not as strong and then we have something like this which is just the outline and if I'm in a rush I'll probably just fill this in completely with this actually I'm gonna do that right now so you're gonna just fill in your brow lightly with this so fill it in and then when you get to the front of your brow like right here you're gonna use upward motion so it kind of looks really realistic you can typically leave it like this it should look something like this and then what you want to do is take your spoolie the end of your spoolie and just brush upwards and brush backwards but you don't want to brush the front back I say I say you want to brush the front forward like this to create like real hair effects you know you get what I'm saying and back on your face okay now now that that brow is snatched you know, I'm gonna take my e.l.f. concealer palette, this right here, let me tell you, it's my baby. Like, I love this concealer palette, and this is in the shade medium, I believe, but you're just gonna clean up, even though I just got my eyebrows done, like, yesterday. Sorry, I'm blocking it. But yeah, like this, clean beauty. Your eyebrows should look something like that. So now that we're back with both brows on, I'm going to start actually with some primer and start on the face. This is the Maybelline primer. So we're going to go back in with the um, e.l.f. concealer palette, last shade and this shade conceal. And we're just going to go over where I'm really red at. Anywhere that you're red, you just want to put this on. I'm going to like tap this in with my hand because I say don't use the beauty blender that's damp. Only because it kind of takes away the purpose of putting the concealer on because it's wet. You want to go like I get really red like in these areas go right here just the warmness of your finger will blend it in but don't worry we're going over this with something so yeah now I'm actually going to take my Anastasia stick foundation and this is in the shade amber and this is like my complete skin you're going to take this and just Now, I wouldn't say take um, the beauty blender yet either, but you're gonna take a stepping brush, 
a stippling brush, excuse me, and this is by Real Techniques, and you're just gonna blend that in. And now we can take the Beauty Blender, which is dip. Now we're gonna conceal underneath our eyes and highlight as well. This is LA Pro Conceal, my favorite concealer. This is in the color medium beige. So have you just wanna, today we're gonna just like tap. Just wanna put it in your highest points. And also you can start, I like to start blending it out with my fingers sometimes first. Take your wet beauty blender. And if it's looking really light right now, don't worry. We're gonna fix that. And so what you also can do is go back in with your foundation brush if you feel like it's too harsh and just, you know, clean it up some. And you should have something like this right now. Small powder brush, the Sasha Buttercup powder, and it's very good powder for a woman of color. I'm gonna take, take the excess off and just go underneath your eyes. And set wherever you get oily, which would be here for me. Here. Wipe that away with the same brush. Black Radiance, I was gonna say real technique. Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette and it's for women of color as well. Anyone can really use it, but. I'm gonna mix these two. And I'm just gonna lightly use the lightest hand ever because this is an everyday look and you don't have to be like super snatched. You know? should have something like this blush this is the milani baked blush and rose Dior brush from real technique all my brushes are mostly from there tap the excess off smile and you want to put it on the back of your cheek now for my favorite part we're gonna Take my fan brush for my highlight, and we're taking MAC. This is their Extra Dimension Skin Finish in Show Gold, and we'll take my MAC Mineralized Charge Water and just spread my brush a little bit. Big Shot Mascara um, collab with Makeup Shayla and Makeup by Mario, I believe. But so I'm just gonna come in with my mascara. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and finish this off. Now that I've finished applying my mascara off camera, I'm gonna go in with my mineralized charge water and just set my face. something like this. So 
Moisturizer by Dior. I like it. I'm gonna apply this. It's just a gloss. Next, I'm gonna use the um, NYX Butter Gloss in Cookie Butter. video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe